afraid. I'm not intimidated. I'm not any of those things. And if anything, it just makes me super focused and um, uh, super, super motivated to continue. <laughs> boy, you have to give her a dues, boy. You have to give her a dues, mate. Do you know what I mean? The road she's walking down is very treacherous, mate. Very rocky. Okay, these are people that have raised the baddest people. Do you know what I'm saying? The baddest people have come through their hands. Who knows what relationships they kept? Who knows who they've got in their phone book? She's saying she's had threats and death threats and all that. I mean, at the end of a long day, all this don't need to be public. Do you understand? The end product will be the court case and the guilty. And when the guilty comes, yeah, it will be scandal enough. You will get what you want. <clears throat> Fundraising. Black people asking for money never looks good. Okay, it never does. So I'm not going to even mention that. But the bottom line is, people, you can either commend this shit or you can see how dangerous it is. All right? Now, people can counteract me and say, that shouldn't stop the right, the righteous path. No, it shouldn't. But you could have done this anonymously with as much strength and conviction as blowing them up live. Like you're putting yourself, I'm, I mean, I heard this girl went to a um, nine nights the other day, right? And people cuss out her blood clot, okay, for being there. Because she's throwing rocks and hiding hands is what they're saying. You're mashing up people's life. You're throwing people on the bus, okay? Now, don't get, like I said, and I've always said it, if, 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 if they're guilty of these things, bro, I'm old school ex-convict, bruv. Sex case, sex case, hang him, hang him, hang him. Do you understand? Yeah? That's why this channel is called Mr. PP9, isn't it? Because I'm old school. Yeah, old school. Yeah, old school PP9. Yeah? But I don't, I don't make none of this. I don't like it. I don't like it because... Let's just say she gets convictions, right? What's to stop her now fucking up other people's names by pointing? And everyone's going to believe that she's on top because she got one or two before, bruv. Yeah, which makes, you know, black people in power, bruv. It's not a good thing, bruv. Yeah, from bus conductors who can ring a bell to stop a bus. Yeah, to those in real positions of power. They only seem to exercise it against their own people, bruv. That's real talk. And become submissive to those of a lighter shade. Yeah, that's real talk. But, you know, I'm not here to call no names. I'm not here to fight no one. I'm not here to, you know what I mean? I had my opinion in my last video. Okay, but I, ne I would never rate this shit. Because at the end of a long day, there are many people in jail. Yeah, many families torn up. Many people's lives fucked, yeah, on false accusations. And there should only be one place that sorts out allegations of this kind. Yeah, and that is a courtroom. And like I said in the beginning, yeah, when it goes through the due process, yeah, okay, and they get found guilty or not guilty, well, there it is right there. But until then, right, and I'm always going to say this, bruv, yeah, look around you at your family, look at the person you love, look at yourself. If you was accused of stealing, okay, bruv, in your workplace, and everyone knows about it, okay, bruv, wouldn't you want? But furthermore, no, they don't know about it. Look, if you got caught stealing in your workplace, you would want the time, yeah, quietly, yeah, to prove that you are innocent. But if people shout out loud before the fact, she just said it, you got to be careful what you talk about when it comes to court cases. But I don't think TC is a good enough abbreviation yeah, especially when you shouted out Yvonne Clark. Do you know what I'm saying? It's not it's not hard, is it? Like, it took me two seconds to realise who you was talking about and it fucked me up, just like when I heard about Africa Bambata molesting kids all these fucking years. I used to spin on my back to that cunt. Do you know what I'm saying? Crutch, windmill and headspin. Buck four and a caterpillar, bro. Do you know what I mean? And now look. Yeah? It's like, it's like, it's like, my history is being torn up, bro. I used to look favor favorably at TC. But you see, I went to jail, you know, 11 years of my life. And maybe this is when all these things were happening, bro. Because I never heard fuck all about any molestation in any of these children's homes other than them ones that have been blown up already, bro. 
To hear that Vassal House is keeping up such shit and to talk about the people that own the restaurants and all that. Like these are the supposed to be the, the echelon, you know, of the blacks, you know, in, in Streatham, Brixton, do you know what I'm saying, Fulton Heath area, the echelon, you know, like the ones that, you know, are supposed to have done it right. Now we all know that a lot of people, when they fuck around with young people, is to get funding from the government. Straight like that. Straight like that. Government finances it. And they just do what they're doing. Now I've seen many a government establishment. Many a dumping ground. Many a dumping ground. I went to a children's home, mate. Or, or I don't know if it was a children's home or a children's bail or stool. I don't fucking know. But all I know is that I was living there. I got a room there. They fed me there. You know, I lived there. Do you know what I'm saying? And I went in there with one case. And I came out of there with 14 in six weeks, mate. 14 cases in six weeks. Because you're put in an environment where everybody is, is quote-unquote unruly. <clears throat> Did I see any of this shit? No, I never saw it. I heard the odd rumour. And I had a girl tell me. But I'm, 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 I'm 14, mate. 15, mate. I don't really... Take, I'm not really taking it. I just want to get out of my situation, isn't it? Do you know what I mean? And the way that I'm going to do that is to leave. Yeah? And that's the night that I was in Stockwell Park Children's Home. And I spoke to the girl that used to go to my school. I couldn't believe she was in there. And she told me that the man keeps trying it on her. Right? But I'm just thinking about, well, tell him no, innit? I'm not thinking about all that big man forcing themselves and all that. I'm looking to get the fuck out of here, mate. First chance I get. If people are guilty of these things, then they need to go to jail. But, due diligence, wait your turn. Just wait. Wait, man. Yeah? Wait. Time waits for no man. They will get their day in court, and they will get found guilty or not guilty. But you see, until then, bruv, there's too much of this shit going on. And whether it's rightly or wrongly done, it don't matter. The, 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 you can't do this. We're not the news, bruv. We're not the police. So even the police don't do this shit. Blow people up like this. This girl, uh, uh, she brave, bruv. She brave. She must have a strong support system. Okay, bruv? She brave, bro. She brave. She brave. She brave, she focused, and she's on her grind. Okay, bruv, I don't want to be her enemy. I don't want to be her friend. Okay? What I do want, though, yeah, is for her to change her tact for her own sake. I mean, Sasha Johnson, we don't know why she got headshot. Whether it was an accident, we're never going to know because the case has collapsed. But she's living with the fucking damage. I don't wish that on no one. I just hope this girl bots clever. And I just think the first opportunity she can get to live somewhere else, she should do it. That's what I think. Okay, bruv, because like I said, bruv, you're dealing with people that have raised the worst. Yeah, okay, know the worst. Okay, bruv, and probably got good ties with the worst, bruv. And, it, I, and it, you know, you know, it wouldn't be nothing for them to get someone to do their dog work. If they're guilty of something and they want to hide the fact, mate, they want to shut her up, bruv. Do you know what I mean? There's many an option in it. But they might go the legal route. And she better win. Because if she don't win, bruv, they're going to sue her, bruv, and cripple her life. Yeah? Okay, so if you if you check for her, bro, yeah, I think you should help her with her fundraising and that. Because she's going to need a strong legal team, I think. You can't keep doing this, bro, and it don't backfire on you, man. Do you know what I'm saying? You know? So, yeah. That's my two cents.